It's great to be doing a benefit for Alzheimer's and raising awareness. It's knowing that your door is always open. It's great to see him still doing what he loves and, and still sharing his gifts with the world, even though um, he's got this disease, he's not letting it stop him from having fun and doing what he loves. It's turned us into uh, caregivers a lot more than we used to be, you know, because we all have to watch out for each other and watch out for our dad, you know, because it shouldn't be all put on my mom. So we all try and help yeah. her out and, and just keep my dad happy because I want him to be happy and just yeah. enjoy his life, you know. It does, it does make, you know, when I'm doing that, it, it, it makes them like, they scratch, yeah, they get it. I want to say, good high on the lyrics. Same. Huh? Okay. Sometimes he'll get confused and lose track of the lyrics, and he, he relies heavily on a teleprompter now, but um, he, he still has fun. Yeah, it's not all bad, actually, because uh, he, sometimes he doesn't remember the solo that he would always do, but he'll just, you know, pull it out of, you know, somewhere, like these long forgotten licks that his fingers still remember, but he never would have thought to do before, so it's, it's kind of fun. You never know what he's going to play. It's always something cool. Mm -hmm. Do you guys remember the, the day that you found out that he had Alzheimer's and what was that like? And just kind of tell me, walk me through that emotion. Um, it was, it was actually kind of a relief to get an actual label for it because we knew he was having a lot of problems with his memory. And so it wasn't a complete surprise that he has Alzheimer's. I mean, we all suspected it, but I mean, it's, it's horrible knowing that because you, you've seen other people go through it and you've seen it on television and movies and stories from friends and it's just, you know, it's not a good thing, you know, so it's, it's pretty devastating. Yeah, I mean, I, I just thought he was going senile early or something for a while, but it's, you know, it's been building for, for a long time, so um, it's good that you know, it was good so we could finally actually get him some treatment. Just cherish them. Just spend as much time with them and love them and don't take any moment for granted while you have it, you know? Yeah, I mean, you don't always get to say goodbye to your family, and, um, you know, when you kind of like know that, you know, he's on the way out, at least, you know, mentally, and, you know, you can really, like, you know, take every moment and try to learn as much as you can from him. Jackson, Mississippi!